I'm Julie Chin. And I'm Justin Fisher. Here's a look at some of today's top stories from 2 News Oklahoma. The House passing a series of new gun measures Wednesday as a response to the numerous mass shootings across the country in recent weeks. The Protecting Our Kids Act, written by Democrats. The act would ban large capacity magazines and toughen penalties for gun trafficking and other purchases. And I'll go to the Senate, which is not expected to take up that legislation. The 2022 St. Francis Tulsa Tough starts this Friday, bringing some of the best cyclists in the world right here to Green Country. And those races are going to cause some road closures throughout the entire weekend. Starting at 7 on Friday morning, parts of the course will begin being marked off. We have a link to all of this weekend's events and closures at KJRH.com. OU softball playing Texas last night in the first round of the Women's College World Series Final. The Sooners, that's staying hot all night. They ended up winning 16-1. to no, OU is now one win, though, away from national championship number six, game two tonight. That's happening at 630. Another thing that's hot, Michael Sager's forecast. Let's get a check right now. Oh, the heat going to build in as we go into the weekend and next week. Today, though, temperatures staying a bit below average, mid 80s for highs. Those outdoor plants, yes, thumbs up. They are a go. If you want to find a patio, enjoy lunch outside, or maybe even dinner outside, not a bad option. Our storm chances do come back up again, though, early tomorrow morning. Scattered showers and thunderstorms will be likely, and some of these will have the potential to be strong to severe with a wind and hail threat. So we'll be watching this closely early tomorrow morning. Thankfully, the tornado threat's very low and not not on that map, there will be at least some localized flood potential as well. Once we get through the storms tomorrow morning, we'll dry out tomorrow afternoon back into the mid 80s. And then here comes the heat. Ooh, mid 90s on Sunday. Hot and humid weather staying with us into the middle of next week as well. You can bet those uh, heat index values are going to be up into the triple digits.